So this is um, part of my mother's reading collection. I'm gonna bring these over to Half Price Books. And I wanna talk to you about something. These printed novels like this provide hours of reading joy, and they're the stories from someone else's mind about life. They can teach you moral and ethical lessons about reality. And what we're gonna do is each one of us gets to bring three in. So Meg's gonna bring in some, and I'm gonna bring in some. I'll post an update with how much money we got net. It's more nutritious than oatmeal, but can be eaten like oatmeal, and it's really delicious. Meg's talking about buckwheat here. It's a distinctive flavor, but it's really, really good. And as we see, it's rich in iron, calcium, phosphorus, fluorine, molybdenum, cobalt, oh no, B vitamins, folic acid, vitamins, and PPE. And look at this beautiful European acacia honey that's pesticide free harvested from the white robinia and yellow Siberian pea shrub in the Acacia Spring. It's a tree that blossoms for a short time, for about a month. It reaches a height of 15 to 20 meters. Numerous large flowersome flowers of white and pinkish color, very fragrant and tender, bunched up in 17 centimeter lengths. As a rule, the demand for this valuable and rare product is huge what is considered to be the best honey in the world. So we got that at that um, Eastern European grocery near Crossroads. And we're really glad to find something from Eastern Europe. Meg wants to eat a proshki, which is also inspired by Russian culture. Pretty nifty, huh? Okay, so what we've got going here is I put the Rove R2-4K dash cam with its suction cup mount in the 2020 loner Nissan Leaf that I still have because Yonker Nissan and Renton's paint repair guy is out on COVID and unable to repair the Arctic white paint on my 2019 Nissan Leaf. So nonetheless, I commute to work in this red 2020 model and since I wanted to test the dash cam, I went and installed it. And you can see I'm down at the Nissan of Bellevue dealer in Eastgate. And I'm gonna zoom in on the display on the dash and the dash cam so you can take a closer look. And this Rove dash cam software is absolutely beautifully designed. It gives enough information, it's crispy clear. In fact, in low light or in fog, you can actually use this to drive if you can't see very well. The informatics display in the dash tells you the charge timing. We're at 14 kilowatts. It estimates it'll take an hour and a half. It's 83%. It says 146 miles on 83%. So we can scroll through the settings here like this. And you can see I'm listening to the radio. That's my average energy economy and so forth. 